want to breathe life into your dated bathroom and that worn vanity? It's easy. Just refresh the cabinets and walls with a fresh coat of paint and they'll look as good as new. Sure, it's a little intimidating if you've never done it before, but it's not as hard as you think if you follow these simple steps. Before we get started, here's what you'll need. Step 1. Choose the right paint. Sometimes choosing the right paint can be the hardest part. For high traffic areas, go with a gloss or semi-gloss paint. It's more washable and more resistant to wear and tear over time. It's important to choose a paint that's designated for cabinets and furniture. If you're having trouble choosing a color, head to valspar.com to speak with one of our color experts. Step 2. Remove all hardware doors and drawers. Next, you'll want to remove all the hardware doors and drawers before you get out the wet cloth and sanding block. Step 3. Wipe, sand, and wipe again. Wipe off any dust or debris and gently sand. Why? It'll help that new coat of paint stick to the surface. And make sure you wipe it down again before you move on to the main event. Step 4. Time to paint. Now you're ready to paint. For kitchen and bathroom cabinets, start by taping off the countertops and cutting in. For more information on cutting in, watch our Painting Basics Interiors video. After cutting in, you can start rolling the side panels and the rest of the frame. Remember to use smooth, even strokes in the direction of the grain. Now that the vanity is drying, we can move over to the garage to paint the doors. You can use a brush or a sprayer if you own one. In this case, we opted for a sprayer, as the paint will go on smoother in half the time. If you're using a paintbrush, it's important to take your time and paint confidently with a strong technique. A 1-2 to two inch brush offers good control, so it's perfect for detail work. Hold the brush near the base of the handle when applying. Paint with enough pressure to bend the bristle slightly. Don't push too hard on the brush. Roll the flat surfaces for a smooth finish. Be sure to paint the doors and drawers with the grain and lay them on a flat surface to help prevent drips. Step 5. Time to dry. It can take at least two hours for your paint to dry. So you know what that means. Time to watch a few episodes of your favorite show. Step 6. Replace doors, drawers, and hardware. Now you're ready to replace the doors, drawers, and hardware. Step 7. Time to enjoy. And just like that, what's old is new again. See, we knew you could do it. For more painting how-tos, visit valspar.com.